so I'm Francesca Manzani and uh, I'm from AIM Group International. So I'm based in Italy and in Florence especially, particularly. And uh, so AIM is an international uh, PCO and DMC group and uh, we have 13 different offices all over the world, especially basically in Europe. So for me it's really a, a lot of, uh, let's say, um, relations, personal relationship, uh, added value in education and, and also in knowing people from all over the countries so that you can get also into the culture of different countries. And honestly, um, for me it's really like being, you know, have, having a family house all over the world. So you can get connected to all different members and you know that your, all your different needs are there. And so wherever you want, wherever you have to bring uh, your Congress, you can have, you know, a, somebody that is part of the ECA networking that can help you. And this is very important. It was in 2004 and it was in South Africa. So it was a great experience, terrific experience. And you know, I went there and uh, for me, I simply knew two people. And so I was really so scared, you know, to enter an association that where I, I didn't know anybody. But it was so easy to, you know, to get introduced to other guys because it gets really a friendship, it's really an open association. So um, ICA, the database in ICA is really a great added value. It's great, really an instrument that you can use on your daily basis uh, to, to know, to get in contact with different associations, with different clients, and also to get, also to, to have an overview of what is going on in a different, you know, part of the world. Uh, because you're always connected to the, also with, um, let's say with the client but as well with the different you know suppliers that are working on that part of the uh, of that particular congress so from my point of view um, the ICA daily database is really a great added value that all the ICA members should you know try and use on a say daily or weekly you know basis and it has been improved a lot in the past uh, in the you know in the past year and nowadays you can really find very, very updated information over there with uh, also information about who are, the, say, the co-PCOs or the AMCs that are you know, uh, managing this, uh, this piece of business, which is really very helpful. Well, first of all, I would like to say thank you to the staff for all the hard work that, uh, I mean, are doing during the during the years, uh, I would like to, to really um, invite also the, all the members of ICA to keep part in this celebration. I mean, for me, the ICA 50th anniversary is really something that has to, to, you know, to have a, you know, an importance. This, is, this has to show how ICA is developing during the years. And this is not a, an arrival point, this is a starting point for the future. So in, during the ICA 50th anniversary, I think that we should take into consideration what has been done in the past, all the development and also the, the shifting of the market that is you know, happening during these years and looking at what, what is, has been done, or what is the present situation and the market scenario and looking at the future, so putting the basis for what will be the future for ICA, for all our members and for all you know, our companies. So I really would like to say hello, yes, just uh, be part of this celebration. Uh, we want to have content uh, in, uh, in these celebrations, so it has to be, uh, yeah, probably not a party, but uh, it has to really 
you know, count for the yeah for the importance of the association and the advocacy that the association can bring to also out of our sector to demonstrate how ICA is um, getting his place, you know, having his role into you know the Congress organization and uh, association management.